Hi, this is Mark at uh, another exciting adventure of LaFloridaHomes.com. I'm sitting in my garden, standing in my garden in late November, and it's going to be December in two days, I think. And look, this is winter in Florida. This is November in Florida. It's just beautiful. Look at all these leaves I have here, this garden. Everything's growing. The leaves are starting to change in the background as fall is appearing. And this is what we do in the winter here. We play. It's cool. It's, it's not hot, but it's cool, so it feels great. There's no humidity in the air. I'm growing my own food. Up north, everybody's hunkered down. Everything's gray. And you have a long winter. I mean, you can't be growing in really October, November, December, January, February, March. That's like five, six months of the year. You can't be growing. Here, I get to play in my garden all year round. And, you know, when you're growing food in your garden in Florida, it's like growing money. Uh, I have so much food that my bill is significantly reduced. This is just part of my garden. I have other areas. I even have apple trees here. This is northern Florida. Yes, apple trees. I have things that you have up north, blueberries, apple trees, raspberries. But I also have things that grow now beautifully. Like this is bok choy. That's, I, uh, this is mustard, a type of mustard. I have beans. I do it all organically. I replenish every, the soil with wood chip. I even use some seaweed from the ocean, believe it or not, and dry it out. I don't know if I'm supposed to be doing that, so don't say anything, but it is good. It has this mineral rich. So if you want to know what to do in Florida in the winter, you can garden, you can enjoy, you can ride your bike. I like the non-HOA communities because I get to do this, but I'll tell you a secret. If you're living in an HOA community and you like to garden, there's Florida state law says you can have any type of vegetation you want growing. Even if your HOA says you're not allowed to, as long as it's indigenous to Florida. So if you want to have a vineyard of muscadine grapes, which I think is indigenous, in your front yard, in the most exclusive HOA, you can have it and they can't say anything to you. So enjoy the weather here in Florida. Come on down if you're up north. It is everything that it's meant to be. I have this huge forest behind me. Not everything is built up. The sun is coming through. It's an endless forest and it's preserved. There's some beautiful places in St. Augustine which you can live in and at a fraction of the cost of up north and, and much better quality of life. Now, what about snow? What if I want snow? I just go eight hours away to Asheville, six hours away to North Carolina, and I'm knee deep in snow. So it has everything here. And I can do that for a week or two and then come on back to this beautiful garden and I feel at home. So this is what we do in the winter in Florida. We not only go to the beach, we not only go to the old town, but we also garden and enjoy. I take my daughter to the park every day, ride bikes, and enjoy vegetables that are better than Whole Foods Organic, which I love personally. So come on down, write me, subscribe, and I'll have more of these videos. Thank you.